YouTube, uh, welcome to another tutorial. I'm actually quite enjoying these tutorials. Um, I am loving this a lot, as people would say. Um, okay, so um, where I left you guys off, you were, you, you were stuck like this. Uh, I'm just going to go ahead and create a cube. And let's just put this on 0 0.5, so it's uh, above the ground. And because I have got uh, something special, which I did not announce I was going to be doing in my last tutorial. Uh, uh, about there, that'll do. Uh, control D, that up, two spaces, three spaces. Control D, cross D, up, D, cross D, up. Okay, uh, duplicate, and then let's just fill that black hole there. Okay, so now we have some nice cubes there. If we go ahead and take a look, okay, where I left you off, you could sprint and jump and so on and so forth. Okay, so yeah, just nice casual and casual. But um, as I was just about to say, it was the point in uh, sprinting if you don't actually. Okay, I just realized something. Walk animation, but no, nah, it's cool. This is only for testing. Yours probably works perfect. I think it's just the way I made my animation. Um, yeah, if we walk and sprint, you can see we, we go the same speed, so it's kind of no point. Oh, and the gun goes through the wall. I'll fix that as well. Um, okay, so oh, I'll go to G here. So, sorry about this. This is probably disgusting for you guys right now. I'm just uh, scratching the hell out of my ear. Okay, so moving back on. Uh, if we go to here. Oh. Crap. Okay, open up the script. I don't know why I just close it down. <laughs> Had a blunt moment there. Um, okay, so what we want to do is basically make it. We want to set right now. We're using this character controller here. Actually, let's just quickly game object create empty. Just call this scene. I always do this. Tidies everything up. Actually, just grab this over here. Untick, untick, and then put those in there. Okay, so as I was saying, we have our character controller here, and he practically goes the same speed as he's walking when he's sprinting. So that's kind of stupid and pathetic. But we practically, we want to go into the script and we want to edit. Is it here? Moving? Yeah, here. We want to edit this max forward speed, say about like, we want to set it from 6, so 6 is default. Uh, all, all three of these, we, we want to edit all three of these and maybe acceleration, we can edit acceleration. Um, we want to edit all four of these then. Oh no, I forgot about acceleration. We don't even need backwards speed, is practically, let's just change that to 3 for now. <laughs> Okay, so um, I'll quickly show you something. Okay, if we move back, you see he moves really slow, but the gun still moves really fast. We're going to set the gun, probably not in this tutorial, probably in the next one, to move at the speed we're moving. Um, okay, we have quite a lot to do, so let's just uh, get on and do it. Ah, we want to create a variable. Let's call this player uh, crap uh, motor. Let's call that player motor. And we can, in here, it's called first person control. No, 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 no. It's first. It isn't first person control. It's something like uh, it's something motor. <laughs> Bear with me here. Character motor, that's it. It's practically the thing we're using. And let's just save that. So it's, if we go into Unity and go to our camera, our animation, we may as well not call this animation, it's just call this. No, let's leave it as animation. <laughs> it's not really exactly animation, it's kind of everything right now. Um, we want to click and drag our first person controller into the motor because that's practically the motor we're busy using right now and 
Yeah, so we're going to continue with this. We have our motor there. We also want a walking speed. That's going to be a float. And what was it? It was six. And uh, a sprint variable. Sprinting speed. That oh crap, no space. Speed, and that's gonna be a float as well, and that's gonna be equal to eight. So save that. Save. Okay, now back down here where it says our player states. We have idle at the top. We have uh, walking, and then we have sprinting. Um, so we idle animation. That's we can leave that where it is. But in these two, we'll do walking first. We practically need player motor. Wait a minute. Dot and move mint. It's doing it again. It's not coming up. Oh well, we we can move without it. Movement. Dot. What's what was it called? It was max. Crap. Forward. Let me just quickly take a look. First person controller. Character motor. It's practically what we're going into. Um, doesn't like you say. So, okay, max forward speed. Okay, max forward speed, and we want that to equal our walking speed. Close that off. Let's copy this. Paste. Paste. We can have space for funsies. And in max forward speed, we want our max backward. Backwards. Backwards speed. Backwards speed. Yeah, split that right. And then, uh, actually, I'm, I'm just going to double check these names. You can go into the character motor script, which is crap. What the hell is this? This is all over the place. I've never actually been into one of these before. Okay, well, we're looking for the variables. There we go, there's all three of them. We want max forward. Let's copy that. And it's, uh, it's that here. And copy this. Paste it there. Oh, crap. No, no, no. Paste that there. Copy this paste that there. Okay, so we got everything sort sorted there. Um, and let's just copy all this and paste it there. Okay, now for the backward speed you obviously want that to be half like I halved it earlier. Except now we want to change everything to sprinting speed. Then backward, obviously, divide by two again. Okay, now if we save it, this should work. If we hit play. Okay, yeah. When we walk in, we walk in normal speed. And then sprint in, he goes a little bit faster. Oh, kind of didn't actually see a difference there. Let's try to get. Oh, okay. I haven't set the. I have. No, first person controller. Animation. Yeah. Hit play. It's about movement wrong. Ah, that makes sense. It's difficult. Movement, 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 movement. Save. Now let's take a look. Okay, so you can move along and normal speed. Sprinting. Okay, yeah, that definitely went faster. Sprinting. And then backward is slow. And then sprinting backward is also slow, but not as slow. 
Okay, so let's just save the scene. The script is already saved. Let's just minimize some of these functions. Okay, well, let me minimize that one. That's cool. I mean, it doesn't have to do what I wanted to do, but okay. So now we have those. Um, what time are we at? Ten minutes. Okay. Um, no, no, you go there. No. Okay. <laughs> That's close. Okay, so now I want to obviously. Um, wait, no, no, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna end this here. Next tutorial, I'll show aiming in and out. And animations moving at the same speed. <laughs>